It's rowdy here in Fist Energy Stadium. Even though the economy is a mess in this city, these are some of the best sports fans in the country. I heard things were so bad that Leland Casino was turned into an Indian reservation, Grim. Yeah, why don't you just open a window and take a leak all over the fans? Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Crooks and Skull Jugulars battle the Leland Burns. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on that things. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. <laughs> It's a four-yard game. Second down and six. Boom to the moon! Another loser fights the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down and two. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. First and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Oh, 
The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Turner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. right there folks and that'll be second down and four he's not just burning down the house he's taking it to the house he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path and the body toll continues to climb Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the uh, no mustard? <laughs> the offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a brutal hit! First and ten. And there's another pick. And this, he is fighting for every yard. Oh, with the brain scrambler. at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit 5. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And the defense gets another pick. Man, oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. And he steamrolls through the... 
the defense on that play and picks up a nice chunk of yardage. Third down and a sliver. First and ten. That guy's so fast he could strike lightning twice. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. First and ten. And another in it. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And this game is up for grabs. one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schlong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the top. Good night, Irene. You ever get hit in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, to hit that guy just took was worse. And it's first and ten. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. Boom, it down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, oh, going in circles. two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Tom. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. The sticky ball, dirty trick. Ah, oh, past the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face and his crotch. I'm gonna see if he cries or pisses himself first. <laughs> Second down and a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot. 
And he's running like a bow. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. Yeah, lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. I, I, one, I, I hope you covered your ears, Briggs. He can go all the way. And it's first and ten. I, At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. And he finds open space. He's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. First and two. He's not going down. Second down and six. Killing the receivers. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. cereal the old nut crunch second down and ten hot, hot one hot two hot eight. bam say good night to that guy bricks ah, good night to that guy bricks you're an idiot it's about a three-yard pickup. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two, eight. He 
had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. I want Sean Kick to make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was try. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, with the brutal hit. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Is the game over yet? I gotta go to the vet to have him reattach my big toe to where my tongue was again. It just fell off for the third time today. I was barely even chewing on it. Hot, hot one, hot. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. <laughs> now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They just be it goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Hot one. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon off. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point in the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the funeral expenses, that is. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. First down and seven. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> 
And it's first and ten. And that's another throw, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay it for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course he... Oh, my God, a man from prison just came out of the field! That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> and the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Vin, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. And that guy is dead. Good riddance. He killed me in my fantasy game last week. I wanted to murder him myself. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex girl Quarterback passes for a touchdown. Take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! First and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Second down and ten. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to start as the teams take the field. This game has been one lopsided route. Yeah, football games are kind of like boobs. Big or small, they're both great. Except for when they're lopsided. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick. But not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. I'm pretty sure my baby sister can throw further than that. But she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And that'll be second and eight to go. And there's another 
Another pick. Man, this quarterback must have. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirt. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it, but no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. Second down and ten. And the defense goes for the juggler and rushes to kill the... Yeah, this guy could talk before he died. What do you think he'd be saying, Briggs? Psycho killer! Just gonna say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this kid. Oh, that's a big time hit. You ever been hit like that before, Brick? The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh, his head just exploded. And it's first and goal. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> first down and five. Second down and more than the QB would like. Ah, another interception. Did you give this? Is he dead? Ah, uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap, I have money on him biting the big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shark is gonna kill me. And it's first and ten. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. You can't keep a good mutant down. And they went to the air and came up big. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he refuses to go down. And he's running like a moose right now. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. First and ten. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. The 
Cleveland Burns got their asses kicked and handed to them today and lose by forfeit. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Phelan read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Grim Blitzro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.